Hey, welcome to another episode in the series I've started putting up on my teardown of my old single wide here. And today we're just going to take all the vapor barrier down and all the bad insulation. And unfortunately there's blown in insulation above the bad insulation. So this project got to be a lot harder than I would anticipated because I wasn't really sure of what to expect. Um, but I did expect most of my joists to be rotten, and oh, that they were. But yeah, this is just the front bedroom here. Taking down that vapor barrier. And I don't know why everything was so dark and black on that vapor barrier, because it didn't seem, you know, the insulation itself seemed pretty clean. So I, I, don't, I don't know what was up with that, but it is what it is. And so for this front room, I just took everything down first. You can see some of the rotten roof joists there. And so I just had it all on the floor. I thought, okay, these, this goes by pretty fast, but then having to bag it up and sort the rolls from the blown in insulation took forever. And so this is the living room. Obviously you got the fireplace there. I didn't record the second bedroom in the middle there, uh, but this is how I started taking down the blown in insulation with the broom and then just swept it up as I went to try to keep it you know somewhat tidy yeah just bagging and bagging it just takes forever and the joists were pretty bad in this room uh, over by the wood stove had a pretty good sized leak but you know with that wood side with that wood stove there it did keep everything from getting all moldy so that that's a good thing for sure I was actually amazed at how many sugar ants were up in this area especially right there where I was brooming it was just there was so many sugar ants and I read on the internet that they don't actively seek out wood to eat but if it's moist and rotten then they'll uh, you know have at it so yeah they did a little damage there but it's not like they're termites or anything or carpenter ants which I don't know much about carpenter ants either so there we go we got a winter wonderland down there and just scoop bag rinse repeat and yeah thumbs up I'm sure that was sarcasm but and we got that finished didn't record all of it and I just wanted to give you a one walls view of what I did with the bat insulation the small pieces I just tossed them the longer ones I took the vapor barrier off set them aside because they were in really good shape and I figured I'd just use those under the subfloor once I ripped that up but so Here's just an overview of uh, one of the rooms there with being fully stripped and yep missing some roof joists there random rot yeah really good stuff so anyway got it all stacked up there temporary storage hope you enjoyed it <laughs> 